You are now ready to start working on the app we'll develop together. But what's life without a little bit of a challenge? And no, your challenge is not to create a Kotlin app on your own. Your challenge is to come up with a plan of attack for how you will develop the app. As mentioned in earlier videos, we'll be developing a game called Time Fighter. It's a game all about beating the clock. The game's quite simple. You have one single button on the center of the screen that you tap to start a game. When the game starts, the timer starts as well. The timer counts down for a specified period, say a minute, and during this time, you have to tap the button as many times as possible. Each tap increments your score, and you have to see how many taps you can get before the timer runs out. Well, it sounds somewhat easy. It can be fairly complicated to execute. It helps to have a plan of attack, that is, a to-do list of items that you need to accomplish. That way you can break down what you want to achieve into manageable chunks of work and suddenly things might start to appear a lot less complex and actually a lot more doable. Okay, so here's your challenge. Take a few minutes, pause the video, and jot everything, everything down you think you may, might need to do in order to get a working game. You can start with something simple like as add a button to be tapped but start thinking about everything you've seen in the demo game I just showed and what elements and actions might be needed to achieve that. Don't worry about it if you don't know how to code these things or not. We'll get to that. All you need to do right now is to make a detailed list as possible. There are no right or wrong answers. All you need first is a list of things to do. Then we'll go about learning how to achieve your objectives. Now, pause the video and get writing. Done with your list? Here's what I came up with. Add a tap me button to the screen. Put some game info on the screen such as what the current score is and time left. When the tap me button is first tapped, it should start the game and show the countdown timer. When the tap me button is tapped after the game has started, it should increment the score. When the timer runs out, the game should stop automatically and then show the final score. I also want to put the app in landscape orientation. We need to make it good. And of course, we'll want to submit it to the Google Play Store. Now that might not be a comprehensive list, but it's good enough for us to get started on. So now that we have our blueprint, let's get coding. <laughs> 